I just want to say thanks for tuning in and whilst you're watching this video if at any point you enjoy it make sure you drop a like on the video by clicking the like button subscribe if you're new around here as well do not forget to turn notifications on to never miss a video and also if you're watching this and you need any cheap reliable coins make sure to check out fifacoin.com and you can use the code koshi at checkout to get yourself a cheeky discount Hope you enjoy. How's it going guys? Welcome back to another video and that's right, the title you see right there is 100% correct. In this video, you're going to find out how to make a ton of coins super, super quick. And you're probably thinking, it's a, is it a trading method? Well, no it's not, okay? It's not a trading method and you don't have to buy any coins, you don't have to transfer anything to your account, it's nothing illegal, okay? Don't worry, you're not in any trouble. But if you watch this entire video, I'm going to show you a way to make a ton of coins using a single app on your phone that is based on FIFA 19. Now this app allows you to earn coins on the app itself. So FIFA 19 coins, you earn it on the app itself and then you can transfer those coins onto your account. Now I don't know if you guys remember but a couple of years ago I did a series called Spin the Wheel and the series was basically based on the fact that you spin a wheel, the players you get from the wheel is the players you have to use into your team and basically I did a series of a couple of YouTubers. Well this app is quite similar because what you do on this app is you use coins in the app to spin a wheel and you can earn players from the wheel that you can use to improve your squad. You can then use that squad in different tournaments and different competitions in the app and the coins you earn from all of that you can withdraw it back into your PlayStation or your Xbox or whatever you play on onto your FIFA account. I also want to say that this app is super cool because it's literally like a replica of what you can do in FIFA 19 as well and that's why you can transfer the coins over because in the app as well there's a transfer market and you can use the coins that you have in the app to buy other players on the transfer market to improve your squad and therefore you can use the coins overall to transfer onto your console. This is it right here, I've got it open. I mean, this is my starter squad. I haven't done anything yet. I've got Volks, Magno, you know, a couple of decent players. It's a 66 rated team. I haven't really done anything, but what I have done is bought some coins on the app already. So I've got 50K coins ready to spend. So like I said, the more you improve your team, the more you can actually withdraw to your actual console. So yeah, you press buy coins, you wanna buy some coins. 1,500 coins is 99 pence which is very very cheap 5k coins 199 299 for 10k coins and so on and so forth but you can actually earn free coins as well so if you want free coins if you watch a video you get 50 free coins and remember these coins are going onto the app for you to spend in the app if you don't want to go into transfer market straight away you can spin a wheel and then if you spin the wheel like i said it's a little bit like the series i did a while back you spin the wheel and you earn players from the wheel you have to say that you're over 18 which i am of course right here we go it costs 15,000 to spin the wheel so it's a big risk but if you get someone good, your team will improve massively. Let's go. I'm going to spin the wheel. Come on. Two, one. Come on. It's got to be good. 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 Come on. Please, 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 please. I'll take anything over 80 rated. 85 rated. Oh, goodness. Rice. Left mid rice. We'll take that. Let's go. 85 rated rice. That's a big improvement to our team straight away. We will take him. So you can either... Place a player in your team or you can sell the player straight away, it's up to you. Another thing you can do to earn more coins is to go into competitions on the app. So I've got 35k coins right now, my team is worth 27k coins. If I go to go to competition, you can enter competitions to earn more coins and they don't cost so much as well. It's a free competition by literally just watching a couple of advertisements but you can go normal state competition to join this competition for 1,500 coins. I've only got 35k coins so it's gonna drop me down but you can win up to 5,700 coins by winning in this competition so it's a pretty decent return if you win the competition it says you assigned a competition shortly and therefore i just have to wait a little bit and it's going to give me a competition and tell me what to do if i win it i get the reward and i've made more coins than i had before because of the first time i got a pretty decent player from spinning the wheel i'm going to do it one more time remember you guys can buy players from the transfer market or you can just sell the players up to you but i want to spin the wheel one more time because i got a pretty decent player from it so here we go one more wheel spin right here we go Oh, 80 rated striker. To be fair, I wanted a new striker. I wanted to replace that silver. So 80 rated striker isn't too bad. It's not better than Royce, but we'll get Kalinic. We'll take it. There we go. I can swap Kalinic into my squad. So now I've got two new players in my squad that can improve my chances of winning competitions. Now you guys are thinking, Kosh, you said that the coins you earn on the foot app, you can actually move it over to your Xbox or PlayStation account. And that is 100% correct. Now the way this app works is very, very smart. What it does is it allows you to actually access the FIFA 19 market by buying players on there that you can use on the app. So example, if I want to buy Ben Yedda, which I am going to do, I've got 18,000 coins. I go into the market in here. I select Ben Yedda, the exact one that I have listed. I buy him using the coins on here. 
The app will then buy the player using my coin. I will have Ben Yoda on here as untradeable though, but coins will be on my account. It's that simple. And if you guys don't understand it, if you click foot 19 transfers, you click the top eye, you can actually see more about it. You click buy from the foot transfer market, which is what I'm gonna do. It plays the I. It tells you everything you know about it. There's a full on instruction page there if you guys do not understand anything I have said in this video. Right, so I want to go for Ben Yedder as the player to list on my console. This way I'm going to receive my coins over there. So I've typed in Ben Yedder, I press on him, and basically it tells me how much to list him for. So 4,500 for the bid price and 7,100 for the buy now price. If I list that Ben Yedder up, it will actually buy that Ben Yedder for me. And I have the coins on my console and I have Ben Yedder as untradeable in my foot app it's a straight swap it's very very simple be sure to change any of the values that you think are wrong so example the contract and you know the fitness so example my ben Yedda has 28 contracts 99 fitness and i'm also going to list him for 24 hours make sure you list him for 24 hours in case the app can't buy it within the hour so if you listen for 24 hours you definitely get your coins and then you click place order for foot and you confirm that you're going to do it so i'm going to place my ben Yedda. i've listed him on my xbox as well there you go I've listed my Ben Yedda and the app is gonna buy my Ben Yedda and I'm gonna get my coins transferred onto my account. That simple. If you click on view your foot transfer orders, you can click on it and it's gonna show you all the pending orders that you've got going on. So my Ben Yedda is still open because obviously the app hasn't bought the player yet and I haven't got the coins yet. So when the player has been bought, it will say closed and my Ben Yedda will actually be on my foot app as well and it's a player that I can use in my team. Okay, pause. So basically, I listed Ben Yedda up in the wrong way. I didn't do it properly at all. I listed him for three days and I actually made a mistake with the price as well. So the app has been very, very nice to refund my coins onto my app account and now I'm gonna withdraw the coins again using a different player. And this time I thought I'll show you guys exactly how to do it in FIFA as well. So therefore, you know how to get your coins exactly. So on the app, I'm gonna select, you know, how much I want to withdraw. I'm going to do 7,500 to 8,000. I'm going to search the name of the player that I want to use on FIFA to get my coins. And obviously that player will now be on the app and I'll get the coins on my console, of course, like I explained earlier. So the name I'm gonna use is Barrios. That's a player I wanna use, done, and let's search him. 7,500 to 8,000 coins is the buy now range. So I click on him, like I showed you guys before, and now it's gonna tell me exactly what to list him for so that the app can find my card exactly and buy it, and then I'm gonna have Barrios in the foot app, and of course, I'm gonna have my coins on my console. So 4,600 bid price and 7,700 buy now price. Let's do it, let me show you guys on the Xbox right now. Okay, so. 4,600, let's do it. There we go. And also 7,700. Let's do that as well. 7,700, there we go. And I remember guys, you have to do it for one day. So 24 hours, one day, it has to be listed for one day. Otherwise, the app cannot find your card and your card will not be bought. It has to be one day. Right, so 4,600, 7,700. Okay, all the stats are correct. Uh, so now defending, it all looks right. Um, 99 fitness and seven contracts that is correct looks like that is a card i want to list up i'm going to list them up now there we go listed them up there we go now back to the app i'm going to press place order for foot transfer there we go i'm going to accept it of course and there we go i have now listed a new player and i've clicked view your foot transfer orders there we go barrios is there and it is open i did the ben Yedda, obviously as you guys can see i did it wrong so they refunded that i tried again with dini but i did that wrong again i don't know why i, kept, I was rushing so i kept getting to do it the right way but anyways barrios is now done and when he's bought i'll show you guys that he's been bought okay so i've got 11,400 coins left i can enter another competition if i want i can spin the world again if i want i've still not put my other competition yet but i will do later on but there you go guys the app is very simple to use very straightforward you build your team you improve your team you go into competitions and you use the players you get from competition the rewards to get more coins you get the coins you can buy players from the market there's two markets there's a market in the app the footcom market and there's a market as linked with your fifa 19 you list the player and then you can get the coins onto your console and get the player in the app as well it's a very direct swap it's very straightforward very easy to use and that way you can make tons of coins very very simple and very very easily the more competitions you win the more coins you earn and the more coins you can have onto your FIFA 19 account whether it's PlayStation or Xbox remember when signing up you have to pick the right console otherwise you will never ever get your coins and remember guys if you do not understand anything there's always an eye icon in the top right 
right corner that tells you exactly what to do and how to do it. Okay, here you go guys, as you can see, my barriers got bought. It literally got bought within an hour or so. So even though you list it for a day, it wouldn't take a whole day. He got bought, I got my 7.7K coins and barriers is in my foot app as well. If you guys enjoyed the video, make sure you drop a like, check out the app, the link is down below. And I hope you guys make a ton of coins with it like I've done. Like I said, it's very straightforward, it's very easy. And you know what, you won't regret it because you can make a ton of coins per day very, very easily. Thank you guys for what you guys enjoyed and I'll see you next time. Goodbye.